All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to some more No Man's Sky. We have finally arrived at the ship. This ship, no joke, was way out here. Why is it? All right, so apparently there was no clear landing, so we're gonna turn around and make a, another pass here. Still no clear landing. All right, let's take a, uh, another pass. Yeah, so about, it took me almost 10 real-time minutes to get to this ship. It was on the other side of this planet, no joke. There we go. Oh, wow. Why couldn't I have landed like down there? That makes no sense. Yeah, it's not letting me land down there. That is so strange. Launch thruster at 50%. Yeah, I know. Uh, don't know where we're at now. Ooh. Uh, yeah, oops. I'm gonna definitely take this, uh, chrysanite. I don't know if it sells for a lot. Uh, but I'm gonna take it. 13,000 units. Yeah, that sells for a lot. So we're gonna go ahead and take that. So apparently the ship is somewhere over this way. All right, let's get back in the ship and see if we can't, uh, if we can't get a closer landing. We're like way down here. It's like right there. There we go. And It's down there. You know what? We're going to go for it. Destination reached. Here it is. The crash site. It's only a 17 slot ship. That's disappointing. That's only a one upgrade. And it doesn't really have all of that greatest stuff to it. So, unfortunately, uh, this crash site was a bust. We'll go ahead and uh, loot everything that's here. Get some more uh, units in our pocket. Um, I do believe that that is it for this place, so. What is this stuff? I've already discovered that. There we go. Analyze it. Okay. Carbon. Oh, it's thomium. There we go. That's carbon. Alright, let's get out of here. There is uh, actually some... I'll take this carb or this isotope plutonium. We're going to need some of that. Oh, and still don't have that. Where's my ship at? Up there. I wonder if I can uh, use my jetpack to climb up this mountain here. Ooh. Look at that, right to it. Ouch. Alright, so our launch thruster just depleted. Alright, let's get out of here. We're gonna hyperdrive to the next place. Okay, while we're doing that, we are going to move on to the next galaxy here. Alright, here we go. D 
you guys see the spiraling in the galaxies? I'm gonna have to jump. That is like really crazy. I'm definitely gonna have to get a bigger and better ship for this. There's a lot of ships uh, landing in this area. Manufacturing facility detected. Whereabouts is this manufacturing facility? All right, we've got, oh, actually right there, so. We're gonna head over to this uh, space station real quick and sell off everything we've got and kind of see what money we're looking at here. Um, I've got about one more warp left in my hyperdrive, and then we might start looking into a, a new ship. One more warp left. So with that being said, maybe what I should start looking into is crafting what we need. I don't have enough carbon to craft a uh, suspension and I don't have enough zinc either, so we're gonna have to stop at some planets and get some zinc and some carbon in order to craft what we need to make a uh, another warp cell. So hopefully during the time that we are in here doing our trip, this place looks kind of cool. Hopefully uh, during the time that we are in here, some cool spaceships will land and we maybe can trade with somebody. We've got a new life form here. Assistant Noog. The air around the beaked life form smells foul. It seeps into my exosuit and makes me gag. Noticing my expression, the traitor pecks at an element it carries. It breaks the unknown substance into pieces and swallows each hole. There is a deep gurgle, and the traitor emits a gas packet that smells delightful. The creature wipes its empty hands and beams at me with pleasure. Thank it with 10 carbon? Sure. The traitor nods a brief thank you. It pays for my contribution, but... Hmm. Whatever. I probably should have given it something else better, but whatever. Oh, we got a journey milestone accomplished as well. What is it? Met 10 aliens. All right. Here's our uh, intergalactic trade network. All right, we're gonna sell some items here, guys. Emerald. We're gonna sell that. The copper, the platinum. Uh, the Gecknip, the Chrysanite, let's check our Starship inventory, let's sell the Nickel, uh, <clears throat> that's really all we've got, 946,000, buy items, suspension fluid for only 20,000, I'd rather make it, honestly, I don't want to blow my money right now, I'm trying to save up for a, uh, a better Starship here, so... Let's see if anybody's landed outside. We've got that one ship so far. Let's go and see what this guy's about. Let's see if this guy's got anything. He is wanting one point, almost 1.3 million. Wow, he's got a, a 23 slot ship. All of his stuff is depleted. He's not really got a lot of upgrades on that thing. We just had another ship land over here. What's this guy got? This guy 
is asking only 400,000 roughly, and it's an 18 slot ship. He's got an upgraded shield, cooling, advanced cooling sigma, and a phase cooling sigma. Nah, not really worth my uh, my while here. We got another spaceship there, but we're gonna go ahead. We're gonna bounce out of this place, and we're gonna head to our next, uh, our last solar system that we can warp drive to. We've got enough to warp drive to one more place here. All right, guys, we got enough to warp to one more place. I'm almost positive I can't double jump. Nope. All right, let's go back. All right, this is the last solar system we can jump to. And then I'm going to have to uh, stop at some planets and get some materials. I need zinc and carbon in order to make uh, the suspension fluids we need. I'd really like to get a better spaceship before I even focus on that, though. Wow, we, like, went right into the space station here. That was, like, perfect timing. So I think we're going to hang out in this space station for a little bit in hopes that we can get some uh, some space travelers in here. Resource deposit detected. So there's probably not going to be anybody in here right now. So we'll have to hang out for a little bit. Alright, so we're going to hang out for a little bit. I'm going to come up here and check things out while we wait for some space travelers to come in. Because that should have depleted my hyperdrive. Yep. So now I am I can officially make uh, a trade without worrying about losing a whole bunch of stuff. I'm going to take all this carbon, though. Okay, I guess I can't take that one. Here's our intergalactic terminal. Uh, really nothing I can sell to this place that I really want to get rid of, so. Um, some there's some zinc, one for 49 units. Ah, uh, let's go outside and s I think I'm hearing ships landing. All right, we've gotten one ship in here so far. Worst case is we can always come back. Oh, nice shades. I like that. So he is wanting 1.5 million. He's got a 24 slot. Wow. He's got a phase coolant for his beams, cooling for his photon cannons. Wow. 24 slots. That's a good one, but uh, unfortunately, I do not have 1.5 million units for that one. That one's very expensive. Looks like we've got one more coming in. We've got one more ship coming in here. I'm going to hang out for just a minute while he lands and see what he's got. That's kind of a sick looking ship. That's going to be an expensive ship. I can tell you right now. I want to know why? Because it's green. 1.9 million units. Wow. Oh, of course. Can't afford that one either. All right. <laughs> now let's head out of here. All right. Well, let's go head over to wherever this 
mining resource thing is here. Oh, it's just a heridium deposit. That's all it is. Maybe we're just gonna have to uh, touch down on this planet here and abandon building. Where is this abandoned building at? Oh. Where is it? There it is. All right, let's go head to this abandoned building, shall we? These abandoned buildings generally have, I guess it kind of depends on what kind of stuff they might have. And it's like right below us. I was trying to cut as much time off it as I could. I can't quite see it. What are we at time-wise? Alright, we should be able to start ripping straight down to it from here. Hopefully this planet has a lot of stuff in it. I don't know. That almost looks like water down there. I'm worried that that is water. Yeah, that looks like water. This building is underwater, guys. That's unfortunate. Okay, so this building is underwater. I don't know how we're going to uh, manage this one with it being underwater. Yep, there it is. That is way down there too. All right, let's go for it and I'm gonna save at this spot here really quickly. And then we'll head over to the building. Hopefully I've got enough. Oh, this is not going to be good. Oxygen protection is 75%. Can I raise that? By just using this? No. Alright, let's get out of here. Before I drown, oxygen protection at 50%. Oh my gosh, where's the, to where's the top of the water? Oh, wow, thank goodness. Let me get my breath real quick. And then down we go. I don't think there's really any way we're going to be able to get like fully into this place. Not unless there's air inside of it. Hmm. I'm already halfway. Alright, let's get out of here. Oh gosh. That place is gonna be really hard and I'm not really seeing a whole lot of like, like really good stuff in there though. That's kind of a bummer. I really wanted to go in there. I 
All right, well, that's kind of a bust. Jetpack is depleted. Is there anything else on this planet? Hopefully we can find some zinc or something, because that's kind of what we're needing here. Alright, let's take off. This planet has got a lot of water on it, that's for sure. Maybe we'll have to head inland and see if we can't find some zinc or something like that. There's like a weird cave system right there as well. Yeah, we might just end up having to uh, walk around here and see if we can't find anything. Little space station right there. Guess we'll check this out and then we'll uh, scan the area and see if we can find... I see heridium deposits everywhere. Oh my. Temperament. Ambulatory. Don't know what that means. Hopefully that doesn't mean aggressive. Ooh. Nice. Got ourselves a new little blueprint for our gun. I don't know if those things are aggressive or not. Unfortunately, nothing in there. I'll bring out the bolt. They're like right next to my ship, too. Let's take a peek and see what they do. There you go. I fed him. I fed him. There you go. They should be happy. Okay, they're happy. <laughs> I didn't know if they were going to be aggressive or not, so I'd rather feed them and uh, be safe than sorry. That's iron. We don't need iron. Uh, we do have a lot of stuff nearby, so I'm thinking we're probably going to go and uh, check out some of the stuff that we're needing here. But we're going to wrap this episode up here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. We'll catch you in the next episode.